I'm sitting here with just this horrible realization. I have spent most of my days figuring out how I can become physically, mentally, financially, spiritually healthy enough to be able to afford and take care of a child. And not only have I taken that time, but I've done the math and it it does not work out. I am not young enough or fertile enough or financially stable enough to even do another round of IVF. And at 36, like, I'm sorry, like, you're gonna say, like, you have time, like, I don't. Because I can't spend another minute of my life trying to make something work when I'm just fighting upstream. I don't have a support system. I don't have the money. I don't have the resources or the community. And it just kills me. It kills me that I had embryos with my ex-husband that were viable. And they're just gone now. And my future... My future with those children and my life as a mother is just... It's gone, and it's not just that it's gone, it's the fact that it was decided for me by so many other people and factors, and that's what kills me, because it was not my choice, and I'm angry, and I'm heartbroken. will show you the difference between what women believe men want and what they actually want, which is keeping many women either single or sexually inactive. Although today's women may believe it unreasonable, men have surprisingly straightforward preferences and desires when it comes to romantic partners. Qualities such as humility, inspiration, respect, and the ability to be more of an asset than a liability. Let's start with the idea that men are more likely to be attracted to women who are unapologetically feminine in their appearance, behavior, and personality. This includes traits like compassion, nurturing, sensitivity, and curves, all of which are traditionally associated with femininity. However, many modern women mistakenly believe that men want women who play hard to get instead. Moving on, modesty is another quality that many men look for in a woman. This may seem archaic, but many men find a lack of modesty unattractive. To put it another way, a beautiful woman who spends every weekend at the club is less desirable than an average-looking woman who prefers to stay at home and cook for her men. Her career and education are irrelevant to a high-value man because men value women who are secure in themselves and their abilities but do not feel the need to brag about them. A woman's attractiveness to men increases when she displays qualities of modesty and humility. Basic Fairness One of the most fundamental qualities that men seek in a partner is someone who can listen to them without interrupting or trying to take over the conversation. A man will feel more appreciated and respected by a woman who pays close attention to him and takes an active interest in what he has to say. Unfortunately, many modern women are more concerned with being right than with truly listening to their partners. A woman who respects her partner's opinions, decisions, and feelings is more likely to have a happy and healthy relationship with him. Of course, respect is a two-way street, but the reality is that women feel free to disrespect men who are poor, short, and have a lot of flaws, even if they're hanging out with a guy who is told to be responsible for himself. Men would rather have women who are assets than those who are liabilities. We must stress once more that this means they seek out partners who will enrich their lives rather than detract from them. Modern women don't heal their trauma and jump from relationship to relationship, accumulating too much baggage that makes them so unattractive, while men want women who can support them emotionally and mentally, but don't care about her money because her money is just hers anyway. Lastly, men want women who are motivational, not critical. Instead of blaming a man for leaving the toilet seat up, men want a woman who asks them about their day and what they want to eat for dinner. Women mistakenly believe that men place the same importance on the same things that they do, but the reality is that they do not. A wealthy, tall man who used to be a slim, pleasant female. 
I'd love to hear your thoughts on this topic in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons.